What's going on everyone and welcome back. Welcome back to this amnesia. I was actually um, wrapping up Demon Souls right now and I just remembered that I have to do a fucking episode for tomorrow. <laughs> it's uh, it's 11 o'clock at night. Not psyched to be playing this that late, but you know, what am I going to do? It's my own fucking fault. <laughs> Alright, so just to get caught back up on this we are in the castle alexander de douchebag um he hired the guys uh wilhelm and a couple of his boys to kidnap people take them to the castle for experiments what kind not entirely sure there's organic matter all over the walls which we got some chemicals for mix them together for some acid to dissolve that in the refinery which is where we're going right now that's it that's all i can really remember but I'm pretty sure it's enough. I know where we got to go. I know that much. So let's uh, kick off some uh, fucking courage right here. Thank you, Craig. Much appreciated, brother. Hot damn. All right, so I'm going to pump the volume real quick. And then we are going to get right back into it. Amnesia. Here we go. Fuck this. <laughs> I also forgot to upload the original video for Sam. <clears throat> Alright, so let's just go over a quick inventory check here. We got 22 tinder boxes. We are. We'll, we'll pop it up to half. Got slight headache, a few cuts and bruises. Memento says we got to go to the refinery, which we know where that's at. So, also we did change some settings on the computer and the recording. So I'm hoping this goes well. You know, my luck. Probably fucking not. Okay, here we go. Uh, that was the way out of here. Can I parkour my way out? I don't think I can. I'm gonna have to go through the spooky fucking tunnel. I don't think I can that either. Hmm. Already I'm doing a very poor job at this game. What are we supposed to do then? We're we supposed to. Okay, okay. Wait, I got an idea. I got an idea. Can we put this up there? Then we fucking... Wait, let's go from the back side. Come on. I honestly don't think I'm supposed to be doing it. Oh, I can just stack them over here. I'm pretty sure that's why they did that. Yeah, that looks a lot more... Okay, now this is going... I need this to... <laughs> so we're gonna pick this up. This is not going well. So bad. Okay, you know what? Boxes probably stack better. That's fine. We'll do it this way. We'll come... Put two boxes. Dude, come on, like fucking work with me, please. And then we'll jump with. Maybe we can drag the barrel up afterward. Get on top of the fucking barrel, dude. You were doing it last time. Okay, now you. Oh, I need a little more. Okay, we need to get on this little box right here. This box. Oh, no, no, too much. Did I knock that box over? Yes, I did. If this isn't the way it's done, I'm going to be very upset.
this up on top right there. No, 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 no. Right there. Come on now, dude. What? It's still not enough? Okay, we'll take this box off and we'll put... Oh, no, no, no. This is already going so poorly. I have gotten better at that, though. Just a little bit. This is six minutes of me doing this. Yes! 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 Oh, that's going to be so hard for some people to watch. I already know it. Oh, we got to get out of this crap. That hurts us. That hurts us. Okay, we know that the acid... The acid's for the refinery down here. Yeah, yeah. this up. We're going to use this on this. Do we still have a little bit of it? I hope we don't have to go back and make more. I do not do not want to go through all that fucking barrel stacking Donkey Kong and bullshit again. Six minutes, man. That's great. <laughs> okay, we're in a dark, spoopy room here. Can we light these? Oh, flashback. It sure is dark in here. Yes, and there's a good reason for it. But you can light the lamp now if you wish. What's the reason? For the darkness, that is. Stay close. Huh? Be careful not to stray. What's the reason? Why is it so dark? Pay attention, Daniel. It's important that you keep going straight and make sure not to stray. Y'all don't give a fuck. I'm lighting all these. We're not going to stray. Nope. Not straying. Not this guy. Not us. Not Daniel. Enemies are near. Crouching in the darkness makes you a lot harder to... Can I put these out? So I have to keep the game dark so I can hide, but I also need light to keep my sanity. Oh, 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 oh no, oh, oh. Avoid looking at enemies? What, what, what am I supposed to be doing? I don't even know what I'm supposed to be doing. Oh. Oh. Okay. How's our sanity? Slight headache? That's it? Okay. The dude was in there. I totally forgot I had a lantern. We didn't use we didn't need to use all those tinder boxes. Okay, the enemy went that way, so we're not going that way. We're gonna fucking hide in here. 
Oh my god. My fucking bacon clogged heart is just thumping. Oh god. Get this tinderbox. Uh, tools we can't use. Nothing. All right, lights out, lights out, lights out. Actually, this is a medium room, so we'll keep this light right there. Oh, this is the health that we don't use unless we need it. Fucking game. Look behind the bookshelf. Nope, nothing, okay. Oh, 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 shit. Fuck that door. Okay, let's check this note. 22nd of June, 1839. It's been more than a month since my last entry. After the event inside the underground chamber in Algeria, Professor Herbert insisted I return to England. He said he didn't want to risk forfeiting the entire expedition lest I took a turn for the worse. An excessive decision, in retrospect. But I'm glad it turned out that way. I found my journal this morning in the haphazard collection of things brought home from Africa. Next to it lay the broken stone orb wrapped in cloth. I tried to assemble it, but couldn't. The pieces wouldn't fit together, as if they weren't from the same object. Could I have imagined it all? No. Nope. Was there ever a complete orb? There was a complete orb. Alexander Douchebaggery fucking gave the old swisheroo. Alright, now we'll check out this shit. We're not scared of anything. We're not scared of anything. Crouch walking the whole way. But we are not scared. There's a tinderbox on the floor right here. We're gonna go ahead and grab that. Where does this door lead to? More refinery. Oh, why, hello there. What, 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 what? Oh yeah, let's get some, get some oil out of this shit. I don't, what are we supposed to be doing, man? Nothing. So that was blocked, that door. Check the tops. Oh, no. No, that's just, uh... chest it is not oh, man heart is pumping it stuck something that's clogging the crank and pulley contraption that's too heavy to lift by hand so what's cl what's stopping this Maybe something on the other side? Let's go check it out. We're gonna keep the crawl space available because I'd rather run through a crawl space. Nothing on the other side of this. Anything in my inventory to throw at it? No. It's pounding. Okay, let's go check out some other rooms. I think we need to use maybe one of our more aggressive hand techniques. I was explaining it to Craig at Cigar Club the other day where you have to click the mouse in certain orders when you're doing something or else uh, it won't let you do, like for more aggressive pushes and pulls, you have to do like a right click then a left click while holding it. Oh God, oh God. I mean, <laughs> no problem. No problem at all. Oh! Oh, fuck! 
Get up, Daniel. Get the fuck up, Daniel. <laughs> this guy is just... Twenty-fifth of June, 1839. I feel the need to continue this journal, even though it was intended for my journey to Africa. This must be something very important. I just know it. I've taken it upon myself to piece the orb back together, but it's been more difficult than one might think. The pieces are behaving strangely. They seem to change color, shape, and texture, but ever so slightly. Yesterday, I took careful measurements and notated any significant markings. Today, I confirmed my suspicions. They were changing. I was terrified and rushed off to see the finest geologist in London, Sir William Smith. I approached the subject with care and we discussed how rocks change form. He told me about the nature of glass, how it eventually collapses on itself, like ice slowly melting over the course of centuries. Smith eased my mind a bit, but I can't escape the feeling that these shards have otherworldly properties. Okay, man, glass changing shape over a while is not fucking some orb pieces changing overnight, Daniel. God damn, bro. This is the new hiding spot I like. So we're gonna... Oh, oh shit. Ah. We're gonna go try that crank, but in, uh, in a more aggressive mouse click order. I know Shane's probably thinking we didn't go check out that room across the way. Uh, oops. There's a baby crying. Anything on the pulley itself? There is something on the pulley itself. Oh, we gotta get a barrel to jump on or a box. get high enough to get it out and I am bad at positioning come on dude got it so now we're going to go into a cellar dope So dope. So, so fucking cool. Oh god! <clears throat> it's okay, it's just a fucking hallway, bro. Just a hallway. I think this is the good you guys came here for. <laughs> oh, thank God we're not. Well, we are down somewhere, but. All right, nothing in the corners. Oh, whoosh. Um. Um. What the fuck? I'm not moving until that thing fucking moves, man. Can I throw anything? Can I, like, kick this up and... I don't know where it is. Oh, oh shit! Fuck that, it's over there, man. We're going. Ooh, ooh. Oh, shit. 
It's right fucking here. All right, that way's blocked off. We can't, we can't, we can't, uh, we can't, we can't go that way. There's nothing I can, it's right fucking here. How do I get it to go away? I, I, um... <sighs> it's right fucking... Can, is there anything I can jump on in there? Not quick enough. Alright, I gotta do something. See, he's not, he's, he's playing just as much chicken as I am. We're going, we're going, we're going, we're going. I'm scared of, I'm scared of a fucking water mechanic. Oh God. Can you see me if my lantern's out? So he's just following me. Do we put ourselves into a fucking... Yeah, you go chase that, asshole. Got some health. Okay, we're gonna grab this book and take it with us. Am I supposed to continue down that hallway? Oh shit! Uh, you go check out over there. Oh no! Fucking pro gamer move. <laughs> oh god, that's too big! That's too big! Oh no, 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 no! Okay, we're gonna grab this. There's where we're supposed to go, and we're gonna chuck that shit. Yeah, you go get that. We're gonna grab another one in case we need it later. Oh my, oh my. Oh, I hope we don't need a key for that. No, you go that way. Shit. Oh, a heavy gate. No, no, go away. I can't lift it if you're here. All right, he's not gonna give me all my fucking. Sweet fuck, man. This water mechanic is terrifying me. I hope you're all having a great time. I don't understand. We have to go up and over? No, we don't have to go up and over. I can't. I don't know. I don't know. I know you guys are thinking, Matt, why do you keep doing the same thing? And 
I wish I could tell you I have a better answer. It's not going up anymore the more I click. Fuck this, man. Okay, okay, I'm done, I'm done. I didn't mean it. I can't. Did he not get me? Is there like a button or something? I'm trying all sorts of stuff, guys. Believe me, I am. I really am. I think this is one of those things where this is better played on the controller. I can't do anything about this. Okay, kill me. Get me. I'm done. I clearly can't do shit about it. Is there like a secret hatch or something? Secret lever? Did we miss something? It started out as scary, now it's just kind of fucking annoying. Let's go check the beginning of it. I have no idea. We might just have to call this a fucking half hour episode because I'm fucking... Duck. That's the door we came through, right? I believe it's the door we came through. What? Ah, a lever. Looks like this episode will continue, boys. There's nothing worse than being fucking terrified of nothing that's even fucking there and having to do a goddamn puzzle. So, we're gonna grab this book, get this guy to go over here. Oh, that sounds like it's timed. You better believe counting in here and looking at those seconds about how long I have to get to that fucking doorway. We'll have plenty of time. I'm gonna wait for this to reset. Wow. Okay, we'll turn it off. We're gonna turn it on. Hit the... I'm gonna turn it on and hit the book over there and just fucking get out. Flip it on. Book over there. See you later, sucker. Woo! Woo! Not even looking back. Not even looking back. Oh, there's another one. There's another one. There's another one. Barely conscious. Might need to use that health now. A wound is bleeding quite badly. Alright, we had to double up on that shit. 
Here's a severed limb we can throw. Is there another door over there? Looks to be. Nothing across the way over here, so we're gonna... Throw that shit over there. I'll save this one for later. Oh shit, another heavy door? I see the turn thing right there. Okay, so we're gonna have to go fucking chuck that. Ah, uh, come on. Oh, come on. Come on, 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 come on. Ah, we're gonna crash through it. Woo! 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 Oh! Oh, we were so close. We got one death. <laughs> dead flesh, dead flesh can act as a distraction. We might have opened the gate just a little bit too much. A little bit too much. We got a good spawn point. He didn't take the bait. So this dude is straight eating it. Come on, come on, come on, baby, come on, baby. All right, that's enough for us. Oh, no, it was not enough. All right, we're gonna die. We're just gonna take the hit, we're gonna die. Okay. A little bit more, a little bit more. Heart is pumping. Oh, you know what happened? They decided I'm not good enough at the fucking game, so they took out the uh, the danger element. That's pretty. Oh, oh, oh! Thanks for opening the door, bud. We're getting out of here. It's locked with a simple lock. Of course it is. Okay, let's look for a key. Oh boy. Ooh, it's a. Hold on, my hand gesture's not here. I can't. Wait. Picked up a hollow needle. Guess we gotta do some lock picking there, boys. It's a good thing I was a rogue in my former life. Man, that's pretty bad. So we didn't do well enough on two run throughs. So I guess after two deaths, they take away some of the danger element. So I wasn't scared at all. Oh God, no more water. We're just gonna run through this shit. We're just gonna run through it. Revolting. No clue where we're supposed to be going. Oh, no, there's a switch right here. No, there's not. Why aren't you opening? Why aren't you opening? Oh my god. No, no more fucking uh, water maps, please. I feel like fucking Sonic the Hedgehog when I see the bubbles going up. 
the t and then the, the timer's counting down. You hear that fucking the, the music's going faster and I think that's where I think that's where it all started. The song the hedgehog water levels. Just just all of my anxiety and panic attacks is right there. I learned a lot today about myself. Oh. Well, this is, nope, 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 nope. Wasn't, you know, Castle Douchebag exactly pretty nice. Let's go take a uh, look around, shall we? All right. <laughs> that this records okay it did in the in the in the trial runs of when we adjusted because I won't be able to the guest room we're getting the lay of the land right now this should be a guest room of study also okay uh, do we have any no no mementos we're just exploring right now okay um everything went okay in test recording because I'm not gonna be able to I'm not going to be able to re recreate that supposed fear that was going on at the water level. Now yeah, we're not dealing with you yet. We're going to go check some other rooms. We're going to see what's across this way. Anything above? It doesn't say anything above the door. The calming music stops as soon as you start fucking with this door. Oh no, I guess it just restarted. Okay, we'll check out. There's no label for this. What is this? What's this room? Storage. Okay, so we got a storage, guest room, and a study. And whatever it is over there. Um. Let's check the guest room. We'll check the guest room. That seems like the least terrifying right now. <laughs> I want to stay in this giant room forever. You got, you know, your your weird lady leg fountain. You got your calming music. It's nice. I am starting to feel some lag in the game. My journal is gone. What would they want with my journal? Leads to the study, I'm assuming. It was right next door, wasn't it? What? Okay, we're getting some lantern oil. Oh, we're cool on that. Okay. Anything above? No. Second of July, eighteen thirty-nine. I received a letter today from the Algerian governor's office disclosing the fate of Herbert's expedition. About a week after my departure, Abdullah, one of the men traveling with us, returned from the desert. He was badly injured, as if maimed by a lion. The man rambled deliriously about the expedition being attacked by something horrible. Those lion deserts, right? Eh? quickly dispatched a search party to I look understand for the Sahara, expedition. But, oh, you know. After searching for days, they found the camp abandoned without any trace of Herbert or his men. Tomorrow, I'll retrieve the things they recovered from Herbert's tent at the customs house. I don't know what to make of it, but I'm worried for him. Man, you gotta be worried about us, bro. What upsets me is like, not, not upsets, ooh, hell yes, thank you. Not upsets me, but uh, Daniel was just like, oh yeah, go kill this guy, Alexander. Easy peasy. But he failed to mention all this other bullshit going on in the house. You know what I'm saying? I like these. I really like these well-lit room. Is that a weapon? 
That's a tinderbox. Let's get this tinderbox first. We'll go ahead and check this uh, armoire. Is this armoire? Uh, wardrobe, whatever. I don't trust this game. I want to. Pretty sure someone top of the bed. I don't see nothing. Okay. Got another note from Daniel's diary, number two. 1839. Today I picked up Herbert's things at the customs house. I dug through the trove of documents he had carried and found a log detailing the expedition. The nature of this text ranged from quick notes to colorful accounts of transpired events. I skimmed the pages trying to figure out what might have happened. May 17th, the day I was trapped inside the orb chamber, Herbert dryly states, we covered Daniel after one hour of entrapment. The fuck? This confused me greatly. I was suffocating within minutes. How could I have lasted an hour? I continued reading the peculiar text. Herbert states his facts without judgment or passion, but suddenly I could read frustration into his text. He pushed his men to investigate the underground tomb, an effort which seems to have strained the minds of his men. Madness spread through the ranks, and Herbert had to take some extreme measures to continue. He finally visits the chamber himself, where he retrieves the orb to the surface. His account confuses me greatly. If he has the orb, what are those pieces in my drawing room? Bait and switch, baby. We called it. We're geniuses. Oh no! Oh no, it's an inventory item! What the fuck happened down here? Alright, so we gotta use a crowbar for something. I was really hoping to go Half-Life 2 on this shit, just fucking just whipping it around through the ma map. Okay, so we'll go check this door. I'm pretty sure this leads to the study. It... I don't really know how to... Oh! Oh, I got it! And I broke the goddamn crow... How do you break a crowbar on a wooden door? Let it be here. What key? What key are we looking for, bro? Important key is hidden in the guest room. Ah, uh, this is the guest room. This is gonna be like one of those things where like we have to turn like a candlestick or some shit. I don't know what happened, but during the water scene, during our two deaths, uh. I no longer have a center point cursor, so I'm kind of like guessing where the center of my screen is at times. No, we don't gotta light that shit up. <laughs> Peace! <laughs> Yeet your religion! See, I don't really... Yeah, okay. Oh, oh, what, what, what? Find a place to hide! Find a place to hide! Find a place to hide! It's in the fucking room with me! Oh! Wall hacks? Yeah. 
wood closet. All right, hold on. We're going to go check. We can't just... We can't just leave that room. Because as soon as we go to the far right of it, something comes in. That's the only thing in this room that we can hide in. One of these two. So we'll try this one this time. 4th of July, 1839. I don't know, man. It's done. The orb is assembled. I was awakened by an exhausting nightmare. Shaking and sweating, I retired to the drawing room with a cup of tea. The relic pieces lay spread across the table as I'd left them. But somehow, I knew how it was supposed to be. I fetched the tar, which I had prepared to fix the pieces together, and without fault, I joined them, producing the orb I remembered so clearly. The tar proved unnecessary. It was pushed out from the joining pieces as they merged on their own, with no adhesive. Crikey. The ancient stone relic now rests on my table. Its immaculate surface and perfect shape could have been molded by a factory. This is all too strange. All right, no bait and switch, I guess. We're not going to that side of the room. I'm not playing fucking hide and seek with a goddamn monster. Oh, thank God, there it is. I what? Guess this is a good place to hide it then. We gotta smash it. Yeah. Picked up the machine room key. As the machinist, this next section is going to be a fucking breeze. <laughs> okay, so we got all this room knocked out. Let's get the fuck out of here. Man. Yeah, I'm having heavy frame drops now. No one meant this. We know we have the key to the machine room. We know that. I think we're just going to call uh, this episode as is. I'm kind of worried about the, rec uh, the recording quality. But also, we got a lot of me being a huge pussy. <laughs> We got more footage here than I think we did almost the entirety of Resident Evil 7. <laughs> but, okay, we're going to call this one right here. We can we can go in and out whenever we want. We don't need, a, like, a special recording room like we did with RD7. So we're going to pop out right now. I'm hoping everything goes well with this. And, um, you know, thank you for joining me, Craig. Thank you so much for the beer. And uh, everyone have fun, be safe, and, you know, wear your masks. All right, my dudes. Take care.